victim of pranks and violent threats after posting explosive videos online. We're going to talk to her, also talk to her parents. And the GMA makes a real cautionary tale also in Family Feud. Again, after an 11-year-old girl posted videos on YouTube. Her family says they sparked a nightmare of pranks and death threats. Police are now looking into what they say could amount to a cyber-stalking case. Andrew Canning spoke with the family in the GMA exclusive. Highlights, okay? Jackie Slaughter's jaw-dropping you know YouTube videos are so me. controversial. You know I'll pop a Glock in your mouth and make a flame slushy. They've okay. made her the victim of death threats at just 11 years old. You know what? I just say that you guys have ruined my life. You know, I would never think it would get to this point. Now speaking only to GMA with her parents, Jean and Diane, it's the first time the seventh grader has been out in public since her videos ignited a firestorm. Yeah, I will put some in the bar. Why so much profanity in the videos? It's just, I had no words running through my mind. It was all done live, and that was just a way to get out my anger. Slaughter says she turned her webcam into a weapon in retaliation over online postings about her alleged sexual history. And if you guys consider and begin, like, label me, then you guys are the actual posers, and I'm not a poser. Not helping matters, her father joined in with a tirade of his own. This is from her father, you bunch of lying, no-good punks. And I know who it's coming from because I've back traced it. As a father, I was just trying to support my daughter and get people to stop hating. Their retaliation, now seen by more than a million viewers, only made the taunting worse, taking cyberbullying to a whole new level. When this first started, we were very afraid. I've been getting a lot of death threats. Online people accused me of molesting my daughter. Slaughter says she was sent to a mental health facility after the authorities believed she might be suicidal. She says she isn't, but can see how a tween could be pushed over the edge. I think that it's completely wrong that people would taunt somebody to some degree that they would actually kill themselves over it. And that's actually completely wrong, and whoever is doing it should be locked away for a really long time over it. Now Jesse Slaughter, which is actually her screen name, is about to enter counseling. But these viral videos may just end up haunting her forever. For Good Morning America, Andrea Canning, ABC News, Palm Coast, Florida. And from, looks like you're in San Francisco this Perry, I know that you have spent a lot of time looking into this, but this just seems so out of control.